this week we've been talking about gardening and things that grow. Today we are going to read a story called Eating the Alphabet. These are still things that grow, but it's going to take us from A to Z with fruits and vegetables. Some of them you may not have heard of before, so I'll pick a few out that you may not have and tell you about them. Let's get started. Eating the Alphabet, Fruits and Vegetables from A to Z by Lois Ellert. Apple to zucchini, come take a look. Start eating your way through this alphabet book. A is for artichoke, apricot, avocado, apple, and asparagus. B for blueberry, Brussels sprout, bean, and beet. Broccoli and banana. C for currant, which is like a berry, corn, celery, cucumber, cabbage, cherry, carrot, and cauliflower. D for date. A date is a fruit that is chewy but sweet, and it grows from a palm tree. E is for an endive, eggplant, and F is for fig. G is for a gooseberry. A gooseberry looks like a grape, but it is more sour than a grape. G is also for grapefruit, grapes, and H is for huckleberry. Huckleberries look like blueberries, but they taste different and they're usually a little larger. I is for Indian corn, and J is for jalapeno, and jicama, which grows under the ground kind of like a potato. K is for a kumquat, which is kind of like an orange. And K is also for kiwi and kohlrabi, which is like cabbage. L is for leek and lemon, lettuce, and lime. M is for mango, melon, and N is for nectarine. O is for okra and orange. P is for pineapple, peach, and pear. Papaya, persimmon, plum, and pomegranate. P is also for parsnip, potato, pea, pepper, and pumpkin. Lots of things that start with the letter P. Q is for quince, which looks a little like an apple or a pear, and it's usually made into jelly because it doesn't taste as good just off the vine. R is for rutabaga, raspberry radish, rhubarb, and radicchio, which is like lettuce. S is for Swiss chard, spinach, star fruit, strawberries. T is for tangerine, turnip, and tomato. U is for ugly fruit. Mm, it does look a little strange, I suppose, but it's supposed to taste like the, something between a tangerine and a grapefruit. But it's called an ugly fruit because it's not that great to look at. V is for vegetable marrow, which is a whole lot like squash. And W is for watercress and watermelon. X is for sigua, which is just another word, actually the Chinese name for watermelon. Y is for yam and Z is for zucchini. V and